of the men's 400 freestyle. Going to have some really fast times here. We're going to start with introducing the swimmers here in lane number one. In lane number one, that's Colin Murphy from the Woodland swim team. In lane number two, that's Adrian Lynn from Nation's Capital Swim Club. And another Nation's Capital Swim Club swimmer. In lane number three is Gavin Springer, also from Nation's Capital. In lane number four, the top seed, Matthew Hirschberger. James Murphy is in lane number five from Machine Aquatics. In lane six, Joshua McDonald from Cincinnati Marlins. Brennan Novak is in lane number seven from Rockville Montgomery. And right out the field in lane number eight, that's Joseph Milinovich from Academy Bullets. This is gonna be a very exciting final. Matthew Hershberger this morning Broke the 15 to 16 national age group record for short course 500 freestyle with a 4.16.4. Let's see how he responds tonight with the A final of the men's 400 free. So we'll see what Matthew Hershberger has in store for us tonight. As I said, he broke the national age group record in the 500 free this morning for the 15, 16 age group. National age group record for the long course 400 freestyle in the 15 to 16 age group is 350.68. Matthew's best time is a 356.27, so he's got a lot of time to drop. We'll see what happens, even if he doesn't get it. He's been having a great meet, set a national age group record last night in 1,000. So he's having a great meet, lifetime best in both of his swims so far. Hershberger's out fast, 56.63. Looks like he's just kind of biding his time a little bit. He kind of even split or negative split is 500 this morning. Looks like he's starting to pick up his tempo just a tad here. Now he's pulling away from James Murphy. The only swimmer able to go under 29 seconds so far here. So we'll see what the split is here at the 200 and how he'll be able to come back on the second 200. He's 156.08, so even if he negative splits, he won't go 350, unless he goes 156, 154. That's really tough to do. But hey, he's gonna have a great swim anyway. He's already on pace to go at best time. All he has to do is come back in two minutes. Matthew was 30.09 on that, so that was his first split under 30 seconds. It's like he's trying to pick it up. I think maybe he was just setting things up on that fifth 50. And he's really pulling away now. We got a great battle for second, James Murphy in five, Josh McDonald in six. The Hershberger's coming up to 300 meters. 255-10 up to 28-9, so he's definitely been setting it up. So as I said, he's not, he probably, I don't think he's gonna get the record unless he comes back in a 55. But anything's possible. That was a 28-9 for Matthew Hersberger. 
He's on pace to go 353, which would be a great swim. Let's keep an eye on this battle for second. Lanes number lanes five and six. James Murphy and Josh McDonald. As Matthew Hersberger comes in. He's going to win the A final, four to three, 352-94. He looks surprised by it. <laughs> he shouldn't be. That's the kind of swimming we should expect to see from Matthew Hersberger in meets like this. So he should be very happy with that. Obviously, he's already qualified for the Olympic trials. Second place, James Murphy, 358 flat, and then Josh McDowell, 358-92. But Josh McDowell just missing the Olympic trials qualifying time. Congratulations to those guys. 352-9. Matthew Hersberger continuing another great meet.